Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today is going to be another uh, build, well, more like an upgrade. Uh, so in front of me here, I have a DPMS Panther AR-15 that I'm going to be doing some upgrade to. Uh, I got a new handguard that I'm going to be replacing. I'm going to be taking off this uh, plastic one here and replacing it with this new handguard. This is an aluminum handguard. Uh, basically, it's going to be a drop-in handguard. It's going to be pretty uh, quick and simple. And I also have a new bolt carrier here that I'm going to be installing. Like I said, it's going to be a, a real quick upgrade to this gun. And uh, let's go ahead and get started. All right. So let's go ahead and start with the easiest one here. It's probably going to be the handguard. So let's go ahead and take this off and put on the new one. Okay. So in order to remove this uh, handguard here, uh, basically uh, there's this ring here that compresses this handguard. Uh, there's a tool out there that you can buy uh, to help you remove this easily. But like I said, uh, you can actually do it with your hands. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, it's really simple. Sometimes hard, but you know you just gotta uh, manipulate it a little bit, and it should come right off. So let's go ahead and give it a try. So basically, you just uh, grab this ring right here and it's gonna compress this. So uh, just push it down and this just lift up like that. So here's the bottom piece. And I'm gonna do the same for the top piece. Again, just press it down and there you go. Came right off. So now you're just left with the gun without the handguard, all right? So let's go ahead and put these guys aside and start installing the new one. Alright, so now that the handguard is removed, let's go ahead and grab the new handguard here. So this handguard is a two-piece handguard. Basically it's held in by some um, Allen screw here. Also came from Allen key. So let's go ahead and remove this. All right, so now that I separated the handguard, all there is to it is making sure that there's a lip here. That's what's going to be dropping in into the side of the um, barrel here with the uh, ring spring compress, the barrel nut. So. <clears throat> Here's the top and there's going to be the bottom here. So it's going to be really simple. Uh, basically, I'm going to show you guys here. Uh, here's the top one here. Basically, you're just going to drop this lip while compressing this down into here like that. So that's the top part right there. Making sure that you're, take it back off. Again, just making sure that your gas tube is in line with the indention of the handguard here. And again, just starting from the bottom, from the barrel nut, compress it down and slide it over. It's that simple. All right, so the next one would be the bottom one. Again, just make sure that the lip here is on the bottom. They're going toward the barrel nut down here. So again, just compressing it a little bit just to slide in. All right, so the handguard is in installed. Um, the next thing would be just uh, putting on the four screws that came with it. So there's four screws that go two here, two here. 
I'm going to be adding some Loctite, blue Loctite on this, just so that it won't back out in the future. So let's go ahead and start with that. In order to put the bow carrier on, uh, we're going to have to remove the lower from the upper. So let's go ahead and double check make sure that the gun is clear, which it is. All right, so very easy process. Basically, there's a pin here and a pin here. We just press it down. Flip it over to the other side, pull it both sides, and it won't come out, it locks, so you don't have to worry about it falling, the screw, the pin falling out. So there you go. Now the upper is removed from the lower, and we can start putting on the new bolt carrier. So to remove the bow chair, it's very simple. Again, just here's the upper. Uh, just pull this back here, and you can see the bow carrier come right out with it. And you just slide this out. So here's the old bow chair, and here's the new bow chair. So this is nitrated, coated. It's easy for cleaning and stuff. So uh, before you put it in, you just want to make sure that. This is straightened and not off to the side because when you start to put it in, it won't go in right. So you basically just want to pull this out, line it up straight, and then just slide it back in. Um, and so while you have it here, um, you can actually check your upper, um, do any cleaning you want to do. Uh, but as far as looking at it, the guns look clean already. It's all oiled up, so I won't be doing anything to it. And just put it on the carrier. <clears throat> now that you got that lined up, you just want to go ahead and slide it back in with the new one. And there you have it. Got the old bolt carry here with the new one put in. Now the next thing is just, um, like I said, now that you have it apart, you can double check, you know, your lower stock also. If you need any cleaning, uh, do your due diligence. Just make sure that the gun uh, doesn't malfunction or anything. Uh, but other than that, uh, let's just go ahead and start assembling it back on, okay? Let's go ahead and put back the lower back onto the upper. Just want to line up the pins again. And once it's lined up, just want to push these back guys back down. All right, there you go. So now that we got the lower back onto the upper, just wanna double check. Everything looks good. All right, so there you go. Uh, also got this uh, laser that was I got laying around uh, So I'm going to go ahead and install this also onto this new hangar I just replaced Just going to loose up this Screws here Gonna 
sliders on. Just to light how I want it. I think that looks good right there. Go ahead and put the screws on. So just snug it in place. There you go. So that's that's what I like about the new handguard here. It got you know so much place to add any kind of attachment you want on it. So just like I say, it was very quick and simple. I just added this laser on here with ease so so that's it guys uh, again just kind of do a quick brief over of what I just did replace it a new handguard a new uh, bolt carrier and added on laser so again if you guys like what you guys see here today make sure you guys like and subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next video thanks